Hey besties, what is up? I'm back again with another video. I'm gonna do a quick intro. I am gonna be reviewing the new ABH Beauty Balm and we're curious to see how it looks. Let me give you guys a spoiler alert. I like it. <laughs> you guys will see in the tutorial how it looks just with the Beauty Balm. It gives you such a pretty, like, youthful radiance and just looks really pretty. Um, it is sheer to light coverage, but girl, you already know. We... We used it a lot. I made sure I put it to the test. I wanted to see how buildable it is. So you guys can see how buildable. I'm going to show you guys a couple layers. <laughs> um, but yeah, you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. So I'm going to leave you guys with that um, before I keep rambling and stuff. But I hope you guys enjoy this tutorial. Hey my loves, what is up? I'm back again with another video, you guys. So in today's video, we are going to be reviewing the new ABH Beauty Balm. Yes, I'm so excited. So this is like a very sheer to light coverage. So let's see. You know you know me. I'm like a full coverage girly. I love like days where I'm wearing minimal makeup and I just have my mascara and like a little light, cover a little light coverage. Before we start, you guys already know my Dutch. So this is a beauty balm. This is a serum boosted skin tint. It does retail for $42 US and $57 Canadian. So yeah, so what it is, it says it's introducing a first of its kind skin tint, a serum boosted formula, providing sheer to light coverage packed with eight skin loving ingredients. It delivers a natural finish and serious care for your skin. Okay, okay, ABH, I see you. You already know that I'd be loving ABH so much, okay? Anastasia, Novena, you guys are the queens. Why you'll love it. Eight skincare ingredients, natural smooth finish, sheer to light coverage, quick and easy to apply. There is a category of fair, light, medium, and deep. So it does have 16 flexible shades. So I'm excited. It does have 18 grams filled weight. So this is the little pamphlet I got. And this is where I tell you this is where it says fair, light, medium, and deep. Okay, so this is what it looks like. Super cool, you guys. So my skin type is combination, oily to combination skin. So I do also have texture. I do have large pores and all that shebang. So with every like foundation skin tint, I do like to prep my skin exactly how I'm gonna be using it. So right here, I'm just doing like a pore filler. And I'll write down everything down below. That way you could see and like if you guys have if you guys have like the same skin type as me. Um, these are the products that I use and that work for me, but you guys could see. What do you guys think? I'm going to show you guys. So this is what it looks like. Super cool. So it does like, you just got to like wheel it up. Let me take the little tapa off and then we're going to put it up. So it does have 18 grams. So, so this is everything. It is pretty thick, you guys. So we do get a lot of product in here. I honestly like the way it looks. Like it's super easy access and everything. So let me put it down real quick before I break another one. So this right here is shade 9. So shade 9. So this is shade 9. To the one that looks like it's broken is shade 10. I'm sad. So... I don't know, I got too excited. Like, I was so mad at myself because I was like, damn it, why did I open it before I actually reviewed it? So I honestly was like, girl, what's going on? But, so don't make fun of me. So we lost a little bit, but it's on the cap, so it doesn't really matter. So this right here is shade 10. And do you guys see a big old chunk came off? Because I ruined it. I got so excited and like, I don't know. Like, I don't know what I did, girl. Okay, so we are just going to leave it at the top. So this is shade 10. This right here is shade 10. So we're going to go with the shade 11. So again. So, and then it's super easy. You could just twist it up. So this is shade 11. Okay, do you guys see? Oh, yeah. <laughs> so this is 12. And let's see if this would be my shade. Let's see. Oh no, it's like, I would use it as a bronzer look. So this is 12. I love how buttery it is. It's really nice. So this is 12. Hmm, okay. I'm going with 11. So I honestly don't know how much I'm going to be using, but I am going to be using like a brush on one side and then 
a sponge on the other side. So this right here on my right, I'm gonna use a brush. Okay, this is pretty good, right? Pretty good coverage. All right, to give it a fair shot, I am gonna be using a clean brush, so there's nothing on here. Okay, let me see how it looks. It looks pretty good. Okay, but I do like the shade 11, so we're gonna go and use it here. So for sure, it gives you that skin-like finish. And like, honestly, I don't know how much to use because I like a full coverage. Um, and when I do use skin tint, I do like like some coverage. And I am going to be using like um, all my products, like where you guys could see how it looks. But right here, this is the side with the brush. Right here. Immediately, it takes the redness away. What do you guys think? So this is the side with the beauty balm and this is with nothing. So this is what it looks like. I think it looks really good. It looks very like skin-like. I'm I'm loving it. So far for first impressions, I'm honestly loving it. Um, let me wash my sponge really quickly. That way I can show you guys how it looks with a beauty blender. Okay, so again, it looks really good, you guys. Like in the mirror, I feel like this is super pretty. Like it's the it's like really close. So you guys, if you guys are close to my shade, shade 11 is perfect. So we're gonna put a good amount. I'm gonna blend it out with a sponge and when you see the sponge like it is humongous it's like the size look at my hand look at my hand I know I know let's just you know who cares <laughs> okay I'm gonna blend it out so because it's so big it blended out really fast um, I feel like if you want more coverage definitely use a brush but with the sponge if you guys want like very sheer even more sheer I feel like this is the way to go with the sponge, but I feel like it looks pretty much the same, not gonna lie. Like, I don't really see a big difference. So for sure, you could build it up. So I'm gonna put a little bit more on this side because I did put a lot on this side. Like, I'm not gonna lie. I was like going crazy with it. I just didn't know how much to put, but um, you could definitely build her up to your liking. So I think it looks really, really good. Oh yeah, my first impressions, I feel like this is for sure a sheer to light coverage. I feel like you can build it up a little bit more if you put more product. I actually like that it's a BB cream in a solid form, so super good. I like stick skin tints, skin, skin tint sticks, yeah. <laughs> they are the 26th, okay, so it does come out on the 28th, so hopefully this is up before then, that way you guys could see and choose your guys' colors. I feel like really nice. I feel really nice. So I'm going to finish up with all like my other products, my cream products, and I'll be back. So this is with my completed makeup. Um, I feel like it looked really good and it worked really good with all my products. Literally everything and my face looks really good. It doesn't look like clumpy or cakey or like patchy. Um, I feel like it worked very well. Like I still look like very youthful. I still feel like I, there's still like this radiant within. So yeah, you guys, you can also too just leave it like that and wear it by itself or do like a very light coverage. I went in with it because I wanted to see like the coverage, like what I can build, you know what I mean? So definitely it is buildable like to your liking. Honestly, this came out really nice. I really love it. If you guys are full coverage like me and you guys love like concealer and all that stuff, you're gonna love it. Um, it really did well, sit well with all my powders. So for my first impressions, I really love it, you guys. It worked very nicely. I'm excited to use it again on a tutorial like a Reels or a TikTok, probably a TikTok, to show you guys like my everyday on the go. So yeah, but this is like my full glam because it's YouTube and I want to show you guys exactly how it performs. So I really loved it. I love the packaging. Um, it's super cute. So they did send me, they did send me four shades and I did use the shade 11. I think that was like the perfect match. If you guys are like my skin tone, like around my skin tone, I think 11 would be really good for you guys. This is all I have for you guys today. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you guys so much for watching. And again, before you guys do click out of this tutorial, make sure you guys do hit the subscribe button and give me a like. Make sure you guys do hit the notification button that way you guys don't miss a post of mine but yeah you guys I had so much fun reviewing this product and you guys already know like abh like never misses and i already knew i was gonna love it so there's a spoiler right there <laughs> love you guys and i'll see you again in my tutorial bye guys